I'm Margaret Trudeau, the wife of Pierre Elliott Trudeau. As you all may know, my husband captured the attention of many Canadians for the many things he did to make Canada a better country. Pierre was the love of my life. I met him in 1967 and we got married on March 4th, 1971. We have three kids, all boys, Justin, Alexander, and Michael Trudeau. Anyways, most of you would know that he was the 15th Prime Minister of Canada for nearly 16 years. He made people and immigrants in Canada feel highly welcome to be in a country of peace and unity. I had a friend by the name of Marina Parker, who was an immigrant that felt extremely accepted in Canada. Here Hi. she is. I'm Marina Parker. I just want to take this time to thank the Lord for the life of Pierre Elliott Trudeau. He was a man, a very hard-working and caring man that hoped and promised to make a change. I lived with my two sisters till I was 16 as I was poor and did not go to school. Places I'd go, I'd be discriminated and made fun of because of the way I spoke and because I was interested in both male and female. To most immigrants, just like me today, he helped shape Canada with his vision of a unified, bilingual, and multicultural just society. When I came to Canada in 1962, it was a year of freedom, where everyone had fully protected equal rights and responsibilities. I started to feel accepted in Canada and believed that I can take pride in artistry. Everyone was treated with love and respect. He fulfilled his promise to make Canada a place to be positively remembered as he embraced multiculturalism. As the person I am today, I stay true to my tradition by remaining constant in cultural festivals and wearing cultural apparel. When I came to Canada, I continued reciting my cultural dances and celebrations. The freedom I had meant to stand up for my cultural beliefs and values, also to expand in knowledge and fruitful wisdom. This being said, I looked at having a different culture in Canada very wow. very good. I'm the happiest woman on earth that I married such a good man that made a change. He also made changes to the divorce laws and loosening restrictions on abortions and homosexuality. His concept allowed people to be motivated and to participate and ensure that people in Canada were comfortable. In other words, he never broke his promise of a just society. His passing away prompted tears and tributes across all of Canada, especially me. Do you think the acts of Pierre Trudeau positively reflects the experiences of immigrants during those years? By the way Marina makes it sound, I do.